Hi guys, um, so I'm going to do a video today about the Beauty Box for October. Um, if you guys don't know what Beauty Box is, it's a monthly subscription to samples. Um, it's similar to the UK version of Glossy Box and the American version of Birch Box. Um, so I'll just get straight into it. Um, that's what it looks like. It comes into a packaging like this. You cut it open and you get a box. Um, Sorry, I had it open like that. Pretty hard and pretty sturdy. Um, I'm going to reuse these boxes and I'm thinking about using them as jewelry boxes or something like that. I'll let you guys know. Um, I've already opened mine up. I um, guess I'm a bit too excited. I'm not too sure. But yeah, um, I'll just get straight into it. So the two products come in a set and it's a shampoo and conditioner by John Frieda. Um, it it's a full body conditioner and shampoo, and it's to restore um, overheated and dyed hair, which is pretty good. Um, it's 1.5 fluid ounces, which is 44 milliliters. They're pretty reasonable sizes, and yeah, I'm gonna use them for traveling. Um, got some samples of the Garnier Body Intensive 7 Days Moisturizer and this is in Sheer Butter which I love Sheer Butter Moisturizers um, I use the Palm, Palmer's, yeah, Palmer's Sheer Butter Moisturizer at the moment um, so I don't know I'll look into these and yeah um, the next one I've got is Two female CK Shock perfumes and two male CK Shock perfumes. Um, I had a whiff of them earlier. I love the men's one, not so much of the women's one. Um, my, actually, my friend actually got this, and I think it just doesn't smell good on me, but it smells good on her. So, fragrance is a very personal thing. Um, so, yeah. Um, it may not work for me. It may not because it may not work for me. It might work for you because yeah, we're different. Everyone's different. Oh my god, I sounded really stupid, but please forgive me. Um, so yeah, um, the next one would be a Shiseido sample foundation. Um, I can open this up for you. It's like that. And a small with a shade in it symbol. It's got a sponge and the powder. It's a powder foundation. Okay, I haven't tested it if it matches me. If it does, I wouldn't be using it as a foundation. I'll be using it as something that will set my under eye um, concealer when I do wear it. I know I should wear it more often, but I just get lazy with my routine. Um, and the last product is a Biotherm Aquasauce Non-Stop Moisturizer. This is a very, very good sample size. Um, I really think it's really good. Um, I don't know if it's for men's or women's because when I smelt it, it, the smell is quite strong and I have a, I'm not too sure if I'm going to be too keen on this because it has a really strong fragrance in it. But I'm willing to give it a go because I heard Biotherm products is really good. And um, I get people hooked up to the men, um, the men range because a lot of men, it's, I know it works really good for men's skin. Um, but I've actually never tried it for the females except for once uh, for my mum. But, um, which was I was a teenager and I don't know, it was okay. Um, because I had good skin at that time, but yeah, and when I want to try biotherm again, so this might help me put my feet in the water with that. Um, and I was looking for new moist night moisturizer anyway, because this doesn't have SPF. Well, it doesn't say it does. So yeah. Um, other than that, that's the products and the highlights probably in the box. Um, the other things that you do get is you get these cards. So you got a welcome gloss, uh, beauty box card, and it tells you all the full size prices and a welcome um, passage. Um, then you got 
to buy the um, stuff. I think it's just like advert advertisement, and it tells you about like the prices and how it's gone down or something like that. Um, basically, kind of showing us how they used to rip us off, and now they can't afford to because market demands or competition. There you go. Then you get the Jordan Freedom, four dollars off any purchase coupon. Then you got the Shiseido, oops, Shiseido card that says you can go get a consultation to find which foundation works for you. So I know I try to make this really quick and really rushed because I think it's I think it's quite exciting, but at the same time, um, I don't know. I'm a bit skeptical now that I paid, um, is it nearly 15 bucks? I don't know if it's $14.50 or $14.99 or something like that. It's $14 something, um, which I will round up and say 15 bucks. There's two versions in Australia. If you don't know, there's Lust Habit and Beauty Box. I just like the way the box looked in for Beauty Box um, and the partnered, partnered brand. So like Biotherm, Shiseido and all that kind of stuff. Um, but after receiving this box, I'm a bit, I'm not sure, um, Last Habit doesn't really have that great ones either, but I'm still going to continue and see how it goes because maybe these products is just not the ones that is best suited for me and hopefully next month might, um, but it's definitely a range of products that I would never buy that I would try. So that's what it's all about. So yeah, I I think it's just a bit expensive in Australia, but then again, everything is um, in America. It's only ten bucks, and here it's fifteen bucks. So I think if it was ten bucks, yeah, I'll be pretty happy. Fifteen bucks, hmm. I know it's only five dollars extra, but I don't know. Um, maybe it's just the concept of it, but yeah. Sorry, I'm playing with the box. Um, I think it's overall okay. Um, I'll let you know with the next box. Because um, I think the last month's box was pretty pretty decent and I liked it. Um, I guess it's just a hit and miss with these kind of things because they are samples anyways. But gives me a variety and I'm happy with that. So i um, going to head off guys. Um, but I hope you guys have a lovely day, and yep, I'll catch you later. Bye.